What's up guys, it's Maxwell back with the next episode of my Let's Max Town Hall 10 series and today we've got two upgrades, one in the beginning and one in the end as you guys are used to because um, the laboratory has just been finishing up so we are gonna restart that right now and uh, I have a card request available in Clash Royale as well as you guys can see um, but I wanna uh, start the um, Lava Hunts today because those are my last uh, significant uh, heavy Dark Elixir upgrade or I guess well the spells like the haste spell and stuff are significant as well um, I don't think the minions are significant uh, at the moment because there is not a huge difference between level 5 and level 6 as you guys can see not really gonna do mass minion attacks at town hall 10 so um, I'm not gonna upgrade those for now I'm just gonna hold off on those guys I'm gonna upgrade lava hounds and then um, the only two dark spells that I'm gonna upgrade for now are then the haste spell and the poison spell um, but let's uh, stop talking get those lava hounds going to level um, 3 right now which is of course the max for town hall um, 10 and then after that I'm probably gonna have to work on my free spell a little bit free spell baby dragons and dragons are gonna be the next priority um, just for yeah being able to hit town hall 11s in clan war whenever I am gonna participate in clan war which is uh, still quite a few weeks from now but um, yeah for that time uh, I'm gonna then upgrade those dragons and baby dragons. I'm probably gonna start with dragons just to make them a significant um, and valuable option because they will be max level for tunnel 10 in one level and then baby dragons after probably free spell along the way and then uh, probably the haste spell next so um, or the, the uh, zap uh, uh, lightning spell as well. So that's sort of the goal for now um, and that's gonna be our first upgrade and then as you guys can see the king he is uh, finishing up in 3 hours and 43 minutes as well, so um, we are going to have to upgrade him to the next level today. That is going to be level um, 27, yeah, so he's going to 26 right now, going to 27 later on today then. Pretty cool as well. And um, yeah, in the meantime I guess we got a bit of time left, so we are going to take a look at a couple of raids which I did as usual, so let's get into that. So I wanted to show you guys, I've actually been doing a little bit of barge over the last few days. My Dark Elixir storage was full, as you can see if you look back at the beginning of this episode. I was at 190k dark, so I couldn't really go with uh, mass minus anymore. So I did a little bit of barge, let's take a look at a couple of attacks. This one, not huge loot overall, but I got a bunch of Dark Elixir for this one, so why not take a look at it in 2x here. Um, so yeah, I've actually been uh, farming up Elixir and a little bit of gold for walls as well. Um, so as you can see, Rage Spell, Jump Spell used here. That's all the spells I use for Barge because I don't really want to progress very far into a base. I just want to um, yeah, get um, some stuff that is uh, near the outside. So a Rage and a Jump are mostly doing the job for me if I net need to get into a base a little bit. Other than that, it's just the usual deploy and pray. Um, uh, with uh, yeah, far farming mines and pumps obviously so um, as I said been using barge to farm up some uh, elixir to fill up the elixir storage you will have noticed that my um, elixir storage if we are heading back to base right here let's just uh, wrap this one up couple wall breakers in there as well for whenever I'll need them so 2600 duck so yeah as you guys can see um, my elixir storage as it is as full as it's ever been it's actually been up to I think over 6 million yesterday um, just because I, I did barge I also dropped quite a few trophies as well during that because obviously I'm gonna lose a bunch of raids doing barge but I don't really care about trophies because I can still find amazing dark elixir bases down here for the miners so and uh, it's actually a lot easier to gain elixir with barge so I'm kinda kinda uh, off the um, being in a high, high league um, strategy right now Let's take a look at a couple more replays where I got some uh, awesome Dark Elixir so that you guys can see that it's also possible down here. So right here, found a pretty juicy Town Hall 9. Only thing you are going to have to be mindful for this one is obviously the funneling as usual. So um, I'm just uh, yeah using my baby dragons wherever I can, far away from those air defenses. And then just by spreading the miners really far, as you can see, they are going straight towards the core and the Dark Elixir storage. And then... Rage heal near the dark is going to be able to take that out. 
I actually decided to drop another rage heal right here just to get the town hall. I'm um, not really sure why I did that, it wasn't really necessary, but yeah, 160 more Dark Elixir. Um, so yeah, that was this raid, 2800 Dark Elixir stolen, so I can certainly work with that, so no worries about um, the leak bonus right here. And then let's take a look at one more minor raid, I don't want to bore you guys to death with that. As you can see, I'm always stealing... Uh, Quite a bit of dark, more than 2,500 usually. I try to get around 3,000, but obviously that's not always possible. So around 2,500 is my minimum target. So um, yeah, this is the next attack, as I already uh, told you guys. Um, once again, the miners coming down the middle right here. Nice funneling. I, I've really gotten uh, quite good at funneling miners with miners and just baby dragons. So um, sort of uh, uh, having an easy way. Most of the times I, I almost never have uh, funnel fails and if you don't have funnel fails with this army obviously I'm picking smart bases so um, I'm never really failing with this to get the Dark Elixir so that's why this uh, attack strategy is pretty cool and so nice without um, heroes as well so um, yeah a couple hours left now until the king is gonna finish up I'm gonna do a few more raids uh, if I find something cool I'm gonna show it off to you guys later if not that's gonna do it for the rating for this video took a look at three of those raids so that's uh, yeah sort of okay I guess and then I will be back with the Barbarian King upgrade a bit later so stay tuned for that and uh, yeah that's it for now so until later all right guys couple hours later we are back as you can see the King has finished his upgrade he's wandering around the base uh, doing his thing right here um, no uh, interesting raids in the meantime so and uh, we are just gonna get this bad guy up to level 27 and that's gonna be a wrap for today then Hope you enjoyed the video one more time and until the next one, I will see you all later. Peace out.